Well, we've got a nine-foot female great white shark that was caught in California by accident by a fisherman and died in, in fishing gear. And she was brought here some months ago and has been in preservative. And today she was brought out and opened up and we removed some of the internal organs, which are well preserved, so that we can pack her and prepare her for display in our moat aquarium. We've been trying to get it ready to go on to exhibit, which means that we have to remove all the internal organs because if any oil gets into the exhibit tank solution, it makes a mess and the exhibit doesn't look nice. So we remove all the organs and we've tried various ways of stuffing and it appears that gill netting is going to work pretty good for us. Um, she's going to go back in the storage tank for now until we have the fundings for exhibit material. And um, she'll wait, but while that's happening, the new solution will take the place of the formalin. And when it go, gets ready for the exhibit tank, then we should have a nice clear solution and a nice unoily shark. Well, Moat has conducted shark research since it started in 1955, and we want to expand the scope of, of our exhibits here to talk about sharks, to, to let the public know more about what kind of research we're doing. And we've got an exhibit opening very soon that shows how we track sharks in the wild. We're going to have exhibits on the history of shark research here at Moat. And this exhibit will show people uh, a great white shark, and an animal that they've always heard about and read about up close and see what this animal really looks like.